ways that the skin hydrates itself is by pulling water into the cells. And it does this with something called natural moisturizing factor. Natural moisturizing factor is a bunch of amino acids that are inside the cell and they bind water. But what's so interesting about it is your body can regulate how much NMF it makes. And so that way, if you're in a low humidity environment, you'll make more NMF and there your, your skin will be more hydrated. If you're in a high humidity environment, like we are here in Miami, you don't need as much NMF, so your skin makes less. So if you look at the structure of the skin, the top of this picture is the outside world, and the bottom of this picture is the bottom layer of your epidermis, which is the inside of your body. When your skin is in high humidity, you only make NMF in the outermost layers of your skin. But then if you move to a low humidity environment, your skin starts to make NMF in different layers. The first day, it'll make it a little bit deeper. The second day, about half of the top of the epidermis of the skin will make NMF. And by the third day, NMF is made in a lot more layers. That's why if you start out in a high humidity environment like Miami, and then you go on a trip somewhere like Colorado where it's very dry, you'll notice you feel very dry and itchy the first three days, but then you're okay. That's because your skin learns to adjust. So it's very important to take a good moisturizer with you for those first couple of days before your skin makes enough NMF. Right now, there is no way to make your skin make more natural moisturizing factor. They haven't found a way to do it with diet. They haven't found a way to do it topically. So there isn't any way that we can help our skins make NMF, but hopefully we will in the future.